Robert Cavalier Sieur de la Salle was born in France in 1642. He studied to be a priest, but the lure of adventure led him to be an explorer instead. At age 23, he sailed to Canada and became interested in animal fur trading. He opened a trading post and became friendly with the Iroquois Indian tribe. The Iroquois Indians told him of a great river that led to the sea. In 1669, La Salle set sail to find this river. He was certain it would lead him to discover a trade route to the Far East. His travels took him through the Great Lakes region. Every new area he discovered, he claimed for the King of France, King Louis XIV. La Salle was appointed the commandant for Fort Frontenac in Ontario. Still determined to find the water route to the sea, La Salle set sail again in 1679. Traveling down the Mississippi River, he established Fort Miami and Fort Creve Coeur. He was also responsible for the establishment of Fort St. Louis. Eventually, La Salle and his crew reached the Gulf of Mexico. La Salle claimed the land from the Appalachian Mountains on the east to the Rocky Mountains on the west, and from Canada on the north to the Gulf of Mexico on the south for France. He named it Louisiana in honor of King Louis XIV. La Salle then sailed back to France to ask the king for money and workers to build a fort at the mouth of the Mississippi River. Upon his return to North America, three of his four ships sank, along with most of his supplies. He and his unhappy crew got lost and couldn't find the Mississippi River. Instead, he landed in Texas and established a colony there. Angry at La Salle for their misfortune, the crew murdered him in 1687. The rest of his colony died of disease, starvation, and American Indian attacks.